I did not announce this to anyone. I just felt like going on, so here I am. <laughs> oh, my goodness. So, happy Friday, friends. You know? I felt like coming on to just say hi to everyone. I hope everyone is doing well and having a great day so far. I just felt like doing a video, so here we are. Hello, hello. Hi, Dawn. Hi, everybody. Hi, Lillian. <laughs> surprise, surprise. <laughs> Hi, friends. How are you guys? <laughs> I just felt like coming on. I missed you guys so much. <laughs> hello, hello. Hi, Sugar. Hi, Cindy. Hi, Penny. Hi, Jen. <laughs> uh, I felt like I just spoke with you. Hi, Laura. Hi, Suzanne. Hi, everyone. So glad you guys can make it. I forgot I left my hanks on the top here. Whoops. So, you were just watching the Zoom. Okay, yes. Hi, Kim. Hi, Sugar. Hi, everyone. How are you? How are you? How are you? So listen, I decided to come on because I realized that not everyone has Zoom. Not everyone can get on. Not everyone is an official yarn addict. So I wanted to do a live where mom's not around. It's just me. <laughs> I wanted to say hi to everybody. Hang out with you guys for a little while. Mom is good. Mom is good. I wanted to spend some one-on-one -on -one time with you guys without mom. <laughs> so here I am. So, yeah. Do you guys like the shirt? Look. <laughs> Crochet fills my days. Yarn fills my everything else, basically. <laughs> yeah. oh. Hello, everyone. Hi, Ruthie. <laughs> oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Surprise, surprise, my friends. So, I decided to do this live. Um... For those of you guys who are coming in, hello everyone. I wanted to do this live because, you know, Sunday I'm with mom and then all the other days, you know, I'm on Zoom and things. So yeah, here we are. Just another way for you to come and see me. You guys like the shirt? Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Guys, don't forget my thummies, okay? There's 165 of you guys in here and only 54 thummies. So when you have a second, just go ahead and hit those thumbs, okay? I appreciate that. Hi, Deb. How are you, friend? <laughs> yes, I am live. You're catching me live, friends. And guess what? I'm live and Ma's not here. I mean, we love Ma, right? But come on now. Every now and then, it's good to not have her here. It's just good to have us. <laughs> oh, God. I, I love Ma. You know what I mean? But I wanted to hang out with you guys. Talk with you guys about all the things and just have a nice little live session with you guys. So, um, yeah. So, yeah, let's see, let's see, let's see. Live solo is also great. Yes, because come on now. I'm the namesake of my channel. <laughs> you know, Juan the Yarn Addict. Come on now. Yes, but you guys love mom. I know that. And you will see her on Sunday. But I wanted to see you guys for myself right now. <laughs> I get you guys first. You guys can have mom later. You know what I mean? So, yeah, it's been a busy week. Of course, of course, of course, a busy week. But you know what? It's Friday, goodness gracious. It's Friday. We're just going to enjoy the evening, have a great time. I'm going to do this live for a little while, and then I'm going to hop onto a Facebook Live and, you know, hang out with my Facebook peeps. So if you're on my Facebook, friends... Um, yeah, we go into the other room. We're going to hang out and have a good time and all the things. <laughs> yes, I wanted you guys all to myself because on Sundays I have to share you with my mother. <laughs> uh, we love Ma, you know what I mean? So, uh, she's still at 999K. My fingers are crossed, friends. We need her to get her to the million. What am I working on? Guys, I'm working on all the things. Um, I'm touching everything. I'm working on the scarf. I'm working on my granny squares. I'm still working on these. Right? And then I'm still working on the eight-sided blanket. 
I have all the whips here, friends. All the whips. You know what I mean? So, uh, and then, and then, okay, in true Juan the Yarn Addict fashion, my friends, right? I pulled some of this luscious yarns out of my drawer. And I'm trying to think of a project, right? Look at this. Luscious Llama. Okay. 100 grams, three and a half ounces, 100 meters, 109 yards. Lush, luscious llama, right? It's in brown. Hello, everyone. Hi, Heather. Hi, everyone. Hello, hello, hello. Guys, Bagger Day gave me this. So I'm trying to figure out what to make with it. You know what I mean? Cardigan. I don't know if I have enough, my friends. There's five Hanks in here, and each one is only 109 yards. So I'm not really sure. But guys, this is Bag of Day yarn. I gotta, I gotta do it up. You know, so I'm sitting here trying to gather inspiration and in all the things. <laughs> a scarf, right? Bot has a cow coming out very soon. It's a shawl. Yes, I have the yarn for that, friends. I ordered it. I ordered the yarn. I ordered the yarn for the project. Where did it go? Um, it's, I, I showed you guys. I don't know where I put it. <laughs> I'll find it and show it to you guys. <laughs> oh, goodness gracious. Make a bag of, yeah. Hello, hello. Hi, friends. Listen, I wanted to surprise you guys by just coming on. I wanted to see... Who does? Who would just, you know, come on if I popped up on you guys? And look at all you guys showing up for me. I love you guys. Thank you so much. I love that for us. Yes, because I don't really do pop-up lives like this, you know? But I wanted to because I thought of you guys, and I'm like, you know what? I want to come hang out with my peeps. I wanted to hang out with you guys, see how you guys were doing. How was your Friday? What are you working on? You know. <laughs> all the things you know what I mean around 1200 of a DK that's so awesome well listen I don't have what do I guys we may have to go into the squirrel's nest we might have to go and look for the yarn that I bought because I don't know if I have 1200 yards of it of the yarn oof 1200 yards friends that's a lot of yards you know what I mean hi Lanny K how are you I hope Mark is doing good. Tell him I said hi. <laughs> yes, I'm glad you guys caught me live too, right? Surprise, surprise, you know? Um, yeah, 1,200 yards of a DK weight yarn, and that scarf she showed in the video, my friends, is beautiful. I, oh, you know what? I forgot. I told my sister, Jax, listen, I, I told her, oh, wait, I'll tell you about hooker versus hooker. It's going to be all the things. So... I decided that, you know, the shawl is very, it's gorgeous, right? It's, it's all the things, but I want to make it for me, right? So I am choosing another colorway for my part of the, you know, the cow. So the, here are the colors. You ready? Hi, how are you, Jax? <laughs> I was just talking about you. <laughs> I was just telling my sister earlier today the colorways that I chose for my bod cow, which it's going to be black, charcoal, it's going to be aubergine, it's going to be dark teal, it's going to be aqua, and ecru, like a white. Those are the colors I am using for bod's uh, shawl along. And... You know, I'm trying to give it some very bold and, you know, I don't want to say the word, but masculine colors. You know, I'm going to see what that looks like. So, yeah. I mean, they're not just masculine colors. I'm going to be diplomatic. But, yeah, I chose those colors because I want to wear it and feel good wearing it with maybe a leather jacket or something. So, we'll see. <laughs> I'm not, you know, I'm going to rock it either way. It's either going to be on me or I'm going to get a mannequin. I'm going to buy a mannequin and I'm going to put it on her. We'll see. <laughs> but I want a masculine looking bod shawl and I think I can do it. You know what I mean? <laughs> I love you guys. What yarn am I using? Well, listen, that's going to be... 
<sighs> up for grabs because I had yarn art flowers, yarn art flowers. I had all of that situated until I saw the shawl and I said, wait a minute, game changer, game changer. I want the colors I just told you. I want that in my shawl. So, you know, I, I'm going to go and see if they have, you know, single colors and I'm going to go ahead and order them. Oh, by the way, I ordered yarn from Pleta. I ordered those yarns from Pleta, so hopefully I have enough yardage. So fingers crossed, that package gets here next week and I'll show you all the things. <laughs> I'm gonna show you all the things. And if it doesn't work out, if the colorways don't fall into place the way I want, then I, it's another excuse to go shopping for more yarn. <laughs> 1200 yards of a three weight and I'm using six colors. I think she said she used seven. I can't remember six or seven, but whatever that is, is what I'm going to choose. And I'm going to make sure they're very bold colors. You love my t-shirt. Thank you. Seven. Yeah. I may choose another colorway. You love my t-shirt. Yes. Friend of the channel got it for me for, you know, happy mail one day. And I'm like, you know what? I'm going to rock the pink. It's good. Seven videos, about an hour each. It's going to be all the things. We're going to love it. So I believe Amazon, I think it was a gift. I'm using a pink because I had, oh, yeah, there you go. Hi, Aaron. Hi, Angie. Yeah. I mean, why not? Use what you have because guess what, friends? I think that she purposely planned, you know, three weight, 1200 yards because, you know, it's a decent fair amount. It's not over the top and it's very manageable. And I think it's very doable. I looked at the video like you guys did and I'm like, we got this. She's going to show us all the things. We're going to go from beginning to end and we're just going to enjoy it for what it is. And I can't wait. I am happy here for that. You know what I mean? Hi, Aaron. Welcome in, my friend. Welcome to the official Yarn Addict Club. It's going to be all the things, my friend. You're going to love it. <laughs> Hi, Dawn. How are you today? Um, yes, Mishy is in the plasma chair. Her phone is dying. Okay. Everyone, Mishy says hello. Um, yes, you love watching my channel. I love that you guys love watching my channel. You know what I mean? Just come hang out, you know. Just get your daily dose of Juan the Yarn Addict and then go on about your day. You know what I mean? It'll be yarn bagging. It'll be ball winding, right? Have some cake with Juan. <laughs> Let's have some cake, friends. Um, and then yarn review. Listen, we're going to do a little bit of this and a little bit of that. And we're just going to have a good time. We're going to hang out, do all the things, you know? <laughs> good evening to everyone coming in. Thank you so much for stopping by to my pop-up live. Listen, very last minute, unplanned. I'm just here to say hi to all my friends. So glad that you guys are here. What does my t-shirt say? My shirt says, crochet fills my days. Yarn fills my literally everything else. Living room, dining room, bedroom, closets. <laughs> because it does, it does friends. If you've been on my Facebook lives, I've taken you around my house. You've seen all the things. I have yarn everywhere. And I'm not embarrassed about it. I'm totally okay with it. True yarn addict fashion. You know what I mean? We love the yarn. <laughs> Good afternoon, Penn. How are you, my friend? Uh, hi, Zorm Dazzle. How are you? It's a perfect t-shirt. And guess what, friends? I'm rocking the pink. Would you ever th have thought? Juan? Pink? What? And look at me now. 2024, here I am. Who's this? <laughs> hello from lower delaware hello friend yes the lower slower delaware it's beautiful down there friends if you've ever been to lower delaware it is beautiful down there they got the beaches up here we have the city <laughs> hi karen welcome to the official yarn addict club you're in for a treat my friends we have all the things happening on the other side of that fence I almost missed you. I was watching Thrust dyeing yarn for Bod Celebration. Yes, we love Thrust, friends. You guys know I'm a huge fan of her yarn dyeing. It's great for that. <laughs> Who's this? This is Juan the Yarn Addict. New phone. Who's this? <laughs> oh, yarn never goes in my closet where I can't oogle it. Right. It's right here, friends. Look. Listen. 
I have no shame in my game. I am an official yarn addict, okay? Mm -hmm. I have yarn. See, this right here back here, friends, is just for a show, okay? Look. See that? Look at that. That's yarn, friends, okay? I have yarn, all right? And not only that, I have an entire attic filled, and the next room, the squirrel's nest, the squirrel's nest, my friends, if you're on Facebook, you have to come find me because we do jammy sessions. I put on my jammies <laughs> and I just chill in the squirrel's nest with all of my projects and we have all the yarn around us and it's all the things. <laughs> One of these days, I'll take you guys over there. You know what I mean? It's going to be, it's going to be so great. Um, yeah. Yes. Bot is at 999K guys. Listen, check your subscriptions. Make sure you guys are subscribed to her. You know how they like to kick people off. You know what I mean? Lars, oh, you, oh, I forgot. You guys are talking about the uh, the thing, the thing, the thing. Hey, Penny, welcome to the official Yarn Addict Club, my friends. I'm so happy to have you. Woo, okay. So, guys, I have 198 thummies, over 300 people in here. Give me a thumb. Give me some love, my friends. <laughs> Come on, yarn friends. Actually, it's squirrel friends. Hello, Thriss. How are you, my friend? I missed you. Huge hugs to you and all of your yarny goodness over there on your channel, dying at that beautiful yarn. I saw, I saw that aubergine. It is beautiful. Ugh. Guys, 999K, okay? We need to make sure we are subscribed because you know how... YouTube likes to kick people off. You know what I mean? Check your subscriptions to her channel. Make sure you're subscribed. Okay? We need to make sure she gets to that one million and stays there. Hello from the UK. Hello, hello, hello. You finally got on a live show again. I'm super happy for you, friend. You are here. It is all the things. <laughs> Hi, Beth. How are you? Hi, Kimmy. How are you? Guys, I'm telling you. You know who dyes some really good yarn? Thriss, okay? Listen, listen. Okay, can we talk about this for a second? Okay, before, look, look at this, okay? This is Thriss, guys. This is Thriss, all right? You guys saw the video. It smells so good. <laughs> it smells so good. <laughs> Her yarn smells good, friends, and it looks just as good as it smells. <laughs> oh, and look, look at this blue, okay? Come on, guys, right? What does one make with something this gorgeous? Hello, right? And then don't even get me started with this red. What? Come on, look, look at this, guys, <laughs> guys. Right? Listen, I may sound like I'm going over the top, but guys, when we talk about yarn, I'm a kid in a candy store. Are you kidding me? And it smells good. <laughs> oh, and then look at this. Look at this. Okay? I mean, oh, guys, uh, guys. <laughs> I'm getting, I'm getting you guys excited about this, and I'm so sorry, but you have to check out her videos when she dyes this yarn, okay? Oh, and it smells good. <laughs> oh, you can't help but laugh with me, you know what I mean? It's Friday night, guys. You know, it's time to shake off the stress of the week and just have a good time, you know what I mean? Shake off that stress, have a laugh, Grab yourself something to drink, work on a whip, come hang out with me. You know what I mean? Uh, Thriss, you have some amazing, amazing yarn here, okay? And no, no, listen, I'm not going to sit here and shout out someone's name about how good it is if it wasn't good. It's really good yarn, okay? When she posts a video, friends, about yarn being available, go watch that. Even if you don't buy it, go watch it. Hey, Mark, how are you, friend? Listen, your work was amazing. I have it set up in the other room. Guys, I got stuff from Mark. Oh, wait, here, look. Mark made this. He's here, Mark. He made this for me. Isn't that amazing? Squirrel. <laughs> 
Would you like to try my blindfold challenge? All you have to do is blindfold yourself and crochet a granny square blindfolded. Um, let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Send me an email, Marsha, please. And I might make a video of it. Yes, yes, yes. And guess what, friends? Thriss is a mod. Like, how great do we have it here? She's here with us in all the things. Are you still waiting on your ice order? Yes, Deanne. Unfortunately, I am. And it's kind of irking me. <laughs> I'm like, where is it already? Uh, hi, Naughty by Nurture. I am great, my friends. Or, yeah, I'm great. <laughs> I feel like I drank a whole pot of coffee, but I really didn't. Um, and before I checked out, I thought of you and bought two Red Heart. Yeah, li listen, okay? I'm an enabler, and I'm so proud of it. I love being an enabler. Wait till Sundays, right? Go on Sundays, buy your scheme, hang out. You know what I mean? <laughs> So listen, I know for the not, um, the hooker versus hooker challenge, I'm not allowed to tell you guys what I'm making. There's a lot of things I'm not allowed to do. But what I am allowed to do is tell you the colors, right? <laughs> but you guys already know the colors, right? <laughs> and you guys already know the yarn I'm using. So there's really nothing to talk about. But I will tell you, I'm super nervous. You were waiting nine weeks for your pleto order? Oh, goodness gracious. I will be devastated if I wait. I ordered last week. Uh, is not feeling so great and clearly use a smell from you. Please let her know you care if you can. Absolutely. Tap Mama knows that we're friends. You know what I mean? And hopefully she catches this later on a replay. And, you know, Amanda, you were in my thoughts. You were in my prayers. I saw that you tried sending me a message last week. Um, I will send you my cell phone number and I would like you to call me or text me so that we can talk and go through all the things. I want to make sure you're good. Okay, so I will definitely reach out to her and I will give her my cell phone number so we can talk. Um, let's see. So the hooker versus hooker happened yesterday. I'm one of the hookers. <laughs> I'm a hooker, friends. I'm one of the hookers. And yeah. All right. Thank you so much for stopping in, Thrice. I appreciate you, fun, uh, friend. <laughs> uh, yes, absolutely. So... Um, yeah, I'm one of the hookers and we have to make an Aragurumi. So the project starts on the first. I have until the end of the month to make it. And then I'm going head to head with other people. And yeah, so there's that. And I have been trying to mull through my brain and figure out what it is that I'm making and no friends as much as I want to make a squirrel. I don't think I can. I don't think I can because I have to use all the colors and I'm not good at putting clothes on a squirrel. <laughs> I don't know if I could put clothes on a squirrel. They just, they're just shaped funny. You know what I mean? <sighs> so I have some other ideas. I'm going to pull some things out, out of my sleeve. You know, I'm going to do the things, you know, just have some faith in Juan the Yarn Addict and we're going to make this happen. One way or another, friends, we are going to make this happen. You know what I mean? You got your dots hooks. So happy for you. I love that for you, Samantha. Thank you so much. Listen, I try to have a good channel. You know what I mean? Great. Well, good is good for me. <laughs> a good channel is good, right? Do a rainbow scarf on the squirrel. Oh, yeah, that would be great, too. Um, but now, hey, sugar, you got this. I have faith in you. Remember, shh, don't speak it right. We can't, right? We can't talk about it right? <laughs> yeah, but see, if we discuss it and I wind up doing it, then I'm disqualified. So yeah, <laughs> I can't, I can't talk about it. I can't, I can't say the things, you know what I mean? Uh, hey, Sherry Ann, welcome to the official Yarn Addict Club, my friend. So happy to have you. You're going to love it on this side of the fence, friend. You're going to love it. Um, so yes, guys, there's 386 of you guys in here, 274 thummies. When you get a second, go to the page thing and hit the thumbs. You know what I mean? Show some love. <laughs> so guess what, friends? Oh, sorry. Squirrel. Hi, Sandra. How are you? Hi, Mateo. Hi, everybody that I miss. Silk Spinner, Original Stitches, and all the things. Hello, everybody coming in. Thank you so much for stopping by to say hi to me and all the things and all the people. So listen, <laughs> so uh, I forgot what I was gonna, oh yeah. So 
So uh, the pattern, there's a pattern coming out for the Genesis scarf. It is finally finished. My person behind the scenes who is putting together all the things, the patterns and things, it's, it's there. It's there. So you guys are going to have this eventually. <laughs> you'll see. You'll see. I'm going to do all the things to it. But I wanted to show this to you because it's beautiful. You guys have seen this, right? It's scarfy. It's magenta and charcoal. It's all done, right? Finishing touches. So my official yarn addicts will get the recipe first. Okay, I will put out a tutorial. You guys will be able to follow the tutorial. Okay, and then if you want the written pattern, my friends, you're going to have to, you know, wait until that time comes and I'll give you further information. Okay, but just letting you guys know, we're getting the ball rolling, friends. I'm now an LLC. Okay, I'm a business. I have the paperwork. We're good. So it's JTYA Designs LLC. That is the name of my business. So Wanda Yarn Attic Designs. And now I'm going to pump out all the patterns and things. We're going to have pictures and it's going to be great. Hello, Jess. How are you, my friend? I'm so happy to see you in here. So good. So yes, so glad to see you guys all here. All 400 of you guys. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. And by the way, friends, if you have any ideas of something that you would like to see me create, send me an email, okay, at hookedcreations123 at gmail.com, and I'll see what I can do. You know what I mean? There's a million ways to make a hat. There's a million ways to make a scarf, my friends. So if you haven't seen it and you want to see it, send me an email, and I'll put something together for you, okay? So, yes, my giggle is contagious. I got it from my father. <laughs> so, yeah, that's the one thing that I did get from him. <laughs> uh, you're shopping your stash for the yarn for Crystal. Oh, yes. Guys, who else is doing that cow? I hope everybody watching me right now is doing that cow. Please tell me everyone is at least going to check the video out at the very least. Please. <laughs> I hope you guys do the cow. Okay. Okay, good, good, good. I'm happy. I'm happy because you guys are doing the cow. So, what I might do, friends, you guys are getting some inside information. You ready for this? So, we know there are people who, you know, may want to do the cow, but they don't really have, you know, the material, right? So, on Sunday's live, okay, tell your friends, tell your friends' friends, tell all the people, okay? What I'm gonna do is I am going to be doing giveaways for Stanley Cakes to help you with your project. So, I don't know right now if I'm gonna do one cake or two cakes. You're gonna have some cake with one, okay? <laughs> so I'm debating on which cake to put up for a giveaway, right? So I'm going to show you what I have now. Now, mind you, I have a Pleto order on the way. So if that comes, it may thwart this, okay? So I am going to be giving away a Stanley cake on Sunday. That's a guarantee, okay? That's happening. So you tell your friends and your friends' friends. And because it's a Stanley cake, friends... I am not going to have mom pick off the iPad. This one here is going to be for the replay winner and I'm going to use the actual software. The software will pick the winner. We're not gonna do one of them things where mom gets to pick. Cause what if she slips? No, 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 we're not doing that. <laughs> so I'm gonna show you what I have in my stash right now and you'll get to see what could potentially be the actual cake that I give up, okay? So, um, and by the way, this is what I was going to use until I saw the actual pattern and design. So now I'm going another route. For, for those of you guys who don't know, I'll tell you in a minute which colorways I'm using. But yeah, I got two of them. Hello, Lorna. Welcome to the uh, official Yarn Addict Club, my friends. Thank you so much. Anyway, let me just do this very quickly. Let me show you the Stanley Cakes. Okay, so here's one. Now, it's 1,200 yards of a DK weight, right? These are all like two weights, I think. 
Anyway, it's a Stanley cake, friends. You guys will make it work. So there's this one. It's like a purple into a blood red. Just like that. I will reach out to Amanda after my live. I'm sending her all my best wishes. Okay. So there's that. This is a Stanley cake. It's 1,200 meters. So there's that. 1,200 meters. This is for Crystal's project. Sunday giveaway, right? We don't know exactly which one of these cakes. I'm going to make it a surprise, but I'm going to show you the cakes. And then on, this is going to be for the Sunday replay. Tell your friends. Tell your friends' friends. They need to come to watch, you know, the video and things. The Sunday live. This is a vegan cake, by the way. Okay? I'm giving away a, a Stanley cake for a Sunday. But you, you have to come and you got to watch the replay. Okay? Next, I mean, this one's not really... This isn't something that I think I'm going to give up. Okay? But we'll see. So it's <clears throat> light and airy color. This isn't the most flattering of colors, but who knows? This is Merino Cake 1000. Okay? Someone may love these colors. I don't know. But it's it's one of the options. Okay? And let's see. What is another colorway here? Look at this. Look at this one. Look at how stunning this is. This is another, these are all Stanley cakes, my friends. This is a souffle from Stanley. Okay, this is potentially one of the options. Okay. Let me just sit that here. And then here's another one. This one is stunning. Look at this. Look at how beautiful this is. Okay, this one here is 1,100 meters. So this, it's more than 1,200 yards. Okay, it's, it's so good. Okay, there's that one. And then we have this one. This one is actually one of my favorites. You know, see? This is something that I could make and wear this. So I get all of my Stenley uh, from Pleto, from Bulgaria. I was enabled by Crystal over a bag of day crochet. <laughs> she enabled me, friends. She showed the, the yarns and I was like, I need to go there. I need to go there. And here's another one, friends. Okay. This is another one. Similar to this one. This is another souffle. So, I mean, some people really go for, like, the bold colors. Some people like the more muted colors. So, you know, yeah. Anyway, I may choose one of these um, for the Sunday giveaway. It's going to be a surprise. It's going to be a surprise. But, you know, you, should you decide to use your winnings for the, the cow, by all means... Or you can just hold on to it and say, guys, I have a Stanley cake. I don't know when I'm ever going to get one again, but I have a Stanley cake, you know? So the choice is yours, okay? But I am giving away a Stanley cake for Sunday, okay? This is, I think this one is my favorite one. I don't know if I'm going to give this one up. Hey, Cheryl, welcome in, my friend. Thank you so much for becoming an official yarn addict. You're going to love it on this side of the uh, fence. Hi, Carrie. Thank you so much for the hugs. I appreciate you, friends. Hugs back. Love that. But yeah, this is my second favorite one. You just joined? Yes. Thank you so much for joining. I appreciate you. Welcome to the official Yarn Addicts. Yes, we do Zooms, guys, every Saturday and Sunday. We put faces to names. If you have Zoom, get the Zoom. Come see us on Saturdays and Sundays. I want to see your makes. Show me what you're working on. If you have any questions, ask away. You know, every Saturday and Sunday, you're going to see me. So there's that, my friends. 
Fireball Shawl. Ooh, that's a good name. Uh-oh. Giving me ideas here. Hey, Scandalous. Yes, thank you so much, uh, Sandra. I appreciate you. Listen, it's all the fun. <gasps> Is Miss C in here? Hi, Mrs. C. I locate... Well, guys, I unofficially adopted her as my Oma. She gives me grandma vibes, and I love that. She's so awesome. Yeah, she is here. Yes. Okay, so those are the choices for Sunday's live. I'm going to just give one of them away, and it's going to be a replay. So attend the live. I'm going to give you some information, and then on the replay... 24 hours later, I'm going to draw for a winner, and that winner's going to get the Stanley cake, okay? And then, of course, I will have lives, like, I mean, sorry, I will have giveaways like I normally do on Sundays. That won't change, but I'm now doing a replay winner, so yeah, there's that. So, you know, I'm doing it because, you know, I'm giving you another option to choose from. If you win, you win. Hi, Mrs. C. Huge hugs to you, my friends. Raphael says hi. <laughs> Look, there he is. He's writing the No Llama drama, having all the fun. Mrs. C, did you see Hooker versus Hooker yesterday? Ugh, I gotta make an amigurumi. <laughs> That's so not fair. I make blankets and wearables. I'm gonna have to do an amigurumi now. <laughs> Ugh, it's okay. We're gonna make we're gonna make the best of it. You know what I mean? It's gonna be great. We're gonna love it. I'm going to make the best amigurumi these two hands can make. That's all I can do, you know? But I'm not allowed to say what's what I'm thinking, you know? I can't say because I'll be disqualified. <laughs> Guys, I'm glad that you have faith in me. But you know what's going to happen? Guys, I think this is what's going to happen. I'm going to start working the ammy, and then I'm going to get hooked. And then I'm going to do ammy after ammy, and I'm going to be on this ammy kick. And then before you know it, I'm going to have Amis all over the place. I'm going to have this and that and all the things. <laughs> I'm going to have this, that, these, and those. I'm going to have everything in here. I'm going to have all the squirrels. <laughs> oh, I'm going to have all the things. I'm not going to know what to do with myself. <laughs> oh, I'm so happy that you have faith in me, guys. I hope I, listen, I hope I pull it off. Good morning from South Australia. Hello, Kathy. Thank you so much for stopping in. Oh, my goodness. And I do have Ami books. I did buy them, you know, because I don't know what to get. So inspiration and things. So I have it. I have the yarn, right? I have the hooks. I just needed the books. Hey, that rhymed. <laughs> oh. So yeah, I listen, my fingers are crossed, friends. I have faith that you have faith in me and all the things. It's going to be a thing. <laughs> oh, goodness gracious. Giveaways. Yes, so I will be doing giveaways on Sundays um, during the live, and then there will be an after um, a replay. But yes, they could potentially be giveaways too, the things that I make, you know? I think someone would love to have a Wand the Yarn Act Ami. As unprofessional as it may appear to look at first. <laughs> You're going to get my best attempt at whatever it is that I make. You know what I mean? <laughs> so, uh, yes, um, Sandra, I actually talked to Mishy before the live. I, t I told her, I said, listen, I got Amy's. What am I supposed to do? She's like, Juan, you got this. Just take a deep breath and figure it out. You're going to be fine. So... Uh, Sugar, yes, your book is on the way, my friend. I just had mom sign it. So when does Sirens Atlas, when can you start Sirens Atlas, my friends? It's a project that we're going to be rolling out sometime after Sophie's. Um, if you want to start now, go go ahead by all means. There are 64 squares. I did not get permission to do tutorials on them, but if you wanted to just, you know, work together on it and things, you can get a head start now. But, you know, we're rolling out Sophie's uh, April 15th, and then Sirens Atlas will be shortly thereafter. So for those of you guys who are interested, this is Siren's Atlas. I've been promoting this book, trying to, you know, gather some interest to just see who's willing and wanting to do this. I was inspired by Ola Joe, the crocheting sailor. These squares represent bodies of water around the globe. And 
inside the book, there's a map. There's a map, and each square represents a port, uh, you know, a body of water. So, so she has not replied yet, and I've sent her two emails. So we'll see. My fingers are crossed. I really hope that she gives us the go ahead. But you know, hi Juan from Ottawa. Amigurumi is fun. I made a tent. Yes, thank you. Um, you bought the siren. Yep. Yeah. Now you have to get the yarn. Yes. So my whole mentality with the whole thing is, is one thing at a time. You know what I mean? Now, for those of you guys who have the book, by all means, go for it. Um, don't hold back because it's 64 squares. It's a big project. So if you have the time to do it, by all means, go ahead and do it. Create yourself a whip basket. Hi, Michelle. Um, did you know she has an app? So yes, but there's a lot of people that access that app and the likelihood of her responding to me is slim to none. Um, so I just sent her like a private email. So yes, I do have a ton of yarn for it. Yep, I do. So I just have to follow the colors, you know? So, hi Lulu, how are you? How are you? How are you? Um, I hope you're well. So hi Nancy. Um, let's see. Yeah, so Kimmy, how are you? Record making the Ami. Um, and then you can teach us how to do it. Okay. Yeah. And then I, I, I found out friends that you can record, like you can learn how to do the Ami and then put your own twist on it. And then it could be your Ami, right? Inspired by. So you can do that. What size yarn does the sirens call for? So I'm not really sure. Let's take a quick look. I know what I want to work using it. I want to use a DK weight or a four weight. That's what I would like to use. Um, and I'm not really sure. I didn't really dig into this. It looks like it's a three weight yarn in here. I'm not sure. Just by first glance. Let me see. Hold on. Yeah, I don't see it here. We'll have to look it up. Um, but I, oh, here it is. Yarn and hook needs. So let's see. You can, of course, use any yarn and hook combination. So the choice is yours. Um, but she is using a DK light worsted, yeah, the DK light worsted cotton yarn and a four and a half millimeter hook. That's what she's using for this. Okay. So I am also doing a Facebook Live, my friends. After this Live, I'm going to go have a salad and then I'm going to go and do the Facebook Live. <laughs> Hi, Lenny from Dallas. How are you? Hello, hello, Marie from Ohio. I'm from nowhere, Delaware. We're this big. <laughs> 10 minutes and you're through it. So, yeah. So, I will be on Facebook Live tonight just to hang out in the squirrel's nest, talk about all the things, more relaxed, you know, hanging out type thing. Guys, bag a day, 999K. Check and make sure you're still subscribed. You know how YouTube does, they kick people off. Just make sure you're subscribed, you know? When you have a chance, go look at it, you know? So there's that. <laughs> um, yeah, not everybody has Facebook. Honestly, friends, I'm not into the Facebook. I'm only on there for my following. Um, that's the only time I really go on there. So, yeah. Um, a two for tonight with one. Yes, it's Friday night, my friends. You know what I mean? I came on here as a surprise to all of you guys because, listen, Sunday we have mom. But I wanted some time alone with you guys. I wanted to hang out with you guys. <laughs> you're from Delaware too, Foxy? Hello, hello. Delaware's this big. I'm sure you're one of my neighbors. <laughs> uh, I'm making my... Oh, you're making my squares. That's awesome. That's so cool. Nice. Yeah. Um, let's see. One and friends is only... The okay. Yes. We hang out. We do the things. We go into the squirrel's nest. We go through the yarn. We talk about yarn. I show you guys my stash. Look. Ready? Hold on. See, I do things like this. See, it looks pretty, but I have yarn over here too that I need to organize. See, that's, that's work over there, you know? So, yeah. We turn it up a notch on Facebook, you know? <laughs> we hang out and we have, we have a good time, you know? How is everybody? How is everybody tonight? I hope you guys are good. Oh, my goodness gracious. 
So let's see. Does anybody have any questions for me? Anything you want to ask me? I'm only going to be on here for another 15 minutes or so, guys. You know what I mean? Um, because, you know, I, I got to have some salad, have dinner, all the things. <laughs> um, can you show the lamb behind you? Who made that? So Janine made this for me. Guys, Mrs. C made Raphael for me. She's in the chat. Look at look at this. Isn't that beautiful? Yep. So there's that. And then Janine made this for me. I fed mom before I came on. See, <clears throat> I was smart today. I fed her already. Isn't this beautiful? This is the no drama llama, my friends. Janine made this for me. It's so soft. It's so pretty. Someday... I could get to be this good someday, but right now, not so good. <laughs> oh, I love this, right? So I sit the no drama llama there and then I have Raphael just, you know, sitting there. Hey, you're just lurking. I love a good lurker. We love a good lurker. I do that all the time on lives. I just hang out with my whips and things, you know. Yes, I did mention that, Heather. Um, it's DK weight yarn, and they also used a four and a half millimeter crochet hook. So there you go. Saturdays at 5 p.m., Sundays at 11. Thank you so much, DN, for that. Um, Team Juan, yes. Listen, we're going to win. We're going to do all the things. Guys, when I go live on Facebook, I'm not pressured for time. So you come when you come. You'll see me. I'll be there. <laughs> I'll be there. Okay, we go shopping. I mean, we've, we've done shopping trips together on ice. I mean, we go everywhere. We do all the things. We sit in here, go shopping. We go in there. We hang out. I might crochet, you know. <laughs> I do everything. On, and I should do that here, but like, no. It's a, it's a different vibe on, on Facebook Live. You know what I mean? It's a different vibe. Um, and then the Zooms, you know? I get to see you guys. So that's cool. So how do you choose a good border? Practice. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> um, I just look at the project for what I'm working. Like, it depends on what stitches I'm using. So if the stitch calls for a lacy border, then I go with a lacy border. I just have to look at the project to see. You know what I mean? So, egg -a bag of sniff socks. <laughs> oh, hello, hello, hello. <laughs> You love the aqua colored yarn cube? You like that? You like that? I love that too. Um, I'm trying to figure out what yarn that is. Just by looking over here, I think it's Big Twist. I think. Redheart with love, did you need? Fruit punch, my friends. Fruit punch. Fruit punch. See, I keep it close by. Did you find your favorite yarn color on Amazon? Yes, and it was $40 for one bag. And I said, sorry, for $40, it is not worth it. I will sit here and suffer. I'm not paying $40 for eight little balls. Sorry, not happening. Not happening, you know? Someone's in the house. Who's in the house? <laughs> I have this one bag, my friends. See, one bag. This is my brick of gold, okay? I don't really care. I don't really care for this one. I'm not a fan of this. I'm a fan of this. Hello, Desi. Welcome in, my friend. So this right here is what I'm looking for, okay? But I'm not paying $40 for this bag. It's the 64627. I have enough of this. You know what I mean? I want this. And I've been asked, Juan, what are you going to do with this? Is Lala in here? Hello, Lala. Huge hugs to you. <laughs> hello, hello, my friend. I'm going to run DK Weight Yarn with the rainbow. Um, so, yeah. No, not $40. I'm not doing it. Sorry. Hello, hello. <laughs> but, yes, if anybody has this and they're willing to sell it to me for less than $40 a bag, then I'm about it. Just let me know. Email me and hook us up. You know, I'll pay you, cash app, whatever. You know what I mean? Mad Mimi is in the house. And I saw Jan, the Alaskan crafters in here as well. 
Hello, hello, hello. <sighs> Desi, I go live whenever the mood strikes. You should see me on Facebook. I mean, I don't like Facebook like that. I don't do Facebook. I'm only on there for the lives and for my, my uh, group. But yeah, I'm here. Decided to say hello to you guys to hang out and have a good time and talk to you guys about all the things. <laughs> Can I drop it like a hot Obi-Wan? Yes, go ahead. Drop, drop, drop. Do all the things. I have 473 people in here. We're going to start dropping some links of some channels that... Uh, Come highly recommended. And yeah, we're going to do that. We're going to do all the things. Hi, Leone. How are you, my friend? I hope everything is good. Let me see. Let me see. You just watched the final of the UK Drag Race versus the world. Oh, please don't tell me who won. I'm going to have to wait and see. Don't spoil the surprise. <laughs> my fingers are crossed for my favorite. Um, Let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Did you see that I am now approved for the YPP program one? Yes, I watched your video. Yes, congratulations. I can't wait for all the things to happen for you. One step at a time, it'll be great. You'll love it. Yes, and guys, please show me some love, my friends. Please, before you decide to bounce out of here, hit that thumb, give me some love, okay? I popped in here to say hi to you guys. Hang out with you guys for a minute. You know, give me some thummies on your way out. How did your C2C go? It's still going, Julie. It's still going. <laughs> hey, Jen, welcome to the official Yarn Addict Club. Giving you lots of love right here. Big hugs. Thank you, thank you. Um, how much Picasso are you looking for, Juan? Listen, if it is this darker one, there's no limit. You let me know and we'll talk. As long as you're not selling it for $40 a bag, we're good. I have plenty of this. I don't need this. <laughs> okay. Um, someone asked me a question about a pattern. Do you have a favorite beanie hat pattern? Claire, guess what my favorite beanie hat pattern is of mine. You're going to be surprised. Ready? It's just a hat. <laughs> it's just a hat, friends. That's my favorite one because it's so easy and it looks good. You know, it's quick, it's easy. You can whip them out, you can donate them. You know, it's good. Um, my favorite one that's not mine is Bod's stitch, uh, her stitch sampler beanie. That's my favorite one that's not mine. But the It's Just a Hat, it's, it's awesome. It's on my channel, left and right hand tutorials. It's so easy. You can literally, it, anyone can do it. So, um, Okay, Toto. Okay, I can't wear beanies. I look like a thug. <laughs> You're hilarious, Jess. I love that. You have that darker Picasso. That jewel colors are amazing. Yes, listen, Leone, if you have it, hold on to it because it's literally a brick of gold right now. Like, no one has it. No one has it. You know what I mean? Um. So, yeah, I'm holding on to mine for dear life. Juan, shawl suggestion for my Hirschner's um, yarn cotton sparkle blue that you sent to me. Yes. The cow that Bot is doing right now, it's about to roll out. Hold on to it. Use that. It's going to look amazing. You don't have to do all those all the colors. You can just run with that. It's, it'll look great. Membership email. Yes. Juan the Yarn Addict. Uh, y, y -T, wait. J-T-Y-A member at gmail.com. That email is exclusively for members. If you're not a member, I won't respond, okay? You have to be a member first, okay? Otherwise, use this email that I use for my channel, which is hookedcreations123 at gmail.com, okay? Hookedcreations123 at gmail.com. Um, what happened? Ice is not showing all the Picasso colors any love. Right, they're holding it hostage. Like, what is going on? And listen, friends, I'll be the first one to admit to you guys, okay? Listen. I don't like working this by itself. That's my personal take on it. I like running DK weight yarn with this, like a white Premier Basics DK in white. I like doing it that way. Um, but that's just me. I know pe plenty of people who will love running that by itself and it's all the things for them. Um, let's see, can you recommend a DK weight natural fiber from Premier, lots of color choices for Crystal's Mail? Um, Honestly, 
not natural fibers. I mean, you can do like a cotton sprout, but I think that is a four weight if I'm not mistaken. Um, I would look at their cottons. Um, their DK weight wools and things like that. I no. I think yeah, this the cotton sprout is really good. Um, but apart from that, yeah. I would go for like a I would go with an acrylic DK weight yarn, but this is hers. This is her 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 cow, so I would go with like a cotton. Um, what do you want to make with the Picasso yarn? Listen, I want to make all the things. <laughs> I want to do um an afghan with different types of granny squares. I have this book. Where is it? Um, of course I don't have it right now because why would I? Let's see. Nope, I don't have it. Oh, here it is. This, see, I have this book. Okay. And what I want to do is I want to thumb through this and I want to choose a whole plethora of different squares. And I want to make an Afghan with this yarn running it with white DK weight yarn. So that's the plan for that. Okay. So. Um, uh, that's a great idea, Jess. Those hexagons you showed, that was great. Love that. Congrats, Cheryl. You made it a month. Thank you so much for hanging out and being a part of our whole team and, and things. Um, microfiber acrylic, yes. Yes, yes. Um, use that yarn to do, yeah. Um, the stained glass um, granny square, yeah. There are several in this book that I can choose from. Yes, and that's another thing, friends. Like, I love books. Um, I got this in Happy Mail. This is great. I love books. Um, what else? I have books all over the place. I, I, I mean, there's this one. Crochet techniques and tips. I have this one. Um, can you do a tutorial on how to read a pattern? Yes, I can. G guys, that's a great idea. I can't tell you how many people come to me and say, hey, Juan, can you teach me how to read a pattern? I think that's a great idea. And guess what? I can do that. I totally can. And I will. I'm going to put how to read a pattern 101. You know what I mean? It's going to be great. I'll go very slowly. For those of you guys that are across the pond, you know, that use UK terms, you know, I'll try to cross reference and be like, you guys call this a, you know, a single, but over here it's a double and things like that and how to read the legend and how to read the steps. I'll show you guys all that. It'll be great. You'll love it. It's so easy. That way, when my patterns come out, you guys can read them. Does, did mama have your book? <laughs> no, I had it on the bottom of a whip basket. <laughs> oh, yes. Um, Laura is trying to get you disqualified. No, she better not try to get me disqualified. She better not. Uh, that's a great idea. I've learned how to read patterns by watching videos. Yes, for, for sure. Um, well, time has truly flown by this year. One month sounds pretty well. And here's to many more to come. Thank you so much, Cindy Lou. I appreciate you. I'm glad that so many people want to learn how to read a pattern, especially my friends that are, you know, abroad because they sometimes have different terms. And I think that if they, you know, get a lesson or two, they can better understand all the patterns that are out here, you know, so that's great. Um, so yeah, I love watching you wind balls of yarn last night. <laughs> I was afraid how that was going. I wasn't sure you guys would actually like that. I wasn't sure, but I'm glad you guys like that. I mean, it's always good to kick up some yarn. What's the yarn on that shelf with the light blue ombre and the purple ombre? That is Red Heart Super Saver Ombre, my friends. That colorway right here is Scuba, and this is Violet, and this is Baja Blue, and this one right here is this one, which is Hot Sauce. That's Hot Sauce right here. This is Anthracite. That's Sunny. And let me slide over. That is Sour Apple, and I don't know, I forgot the name of that one, but yeah. I can, I can, listen, I can show you all the things, you know? It'll be great. Like hot sauce. I want to do a dragon shawl with this. Shh, don't tell nobody. Dragon shawl. I mean, there's tons of dragon shawls, but I want to do my own. <laughs> I want to do my own dragon shawl, you know what I mean? <laughs> so, we'll see. Just, you know, I want a dragon shawl. I want it to be very, like... Wow, look at him with that leather jacket on and his, like, dragon shawl. <laughs> oh, 
Kathy, it's hard to believe it's been a month. I've been so inspired by you. My husband does not understand why. I have multiple whips. Listen, <laughs> tell him to come watch. He'll learn. He'll understand why you have multiple whips. <laughs> um, did you use your 4th of July yarns a lot? Top, middle, shelf. It's in the other room. See, we're going to talk about all that on the Facebook Live. I'm going to go through my variegateds. Um, yeah, so the one I was talking about, it was Sunrise, not Fruit Punch. Thank you, Jen, for doing that. I did not wind it up. It was part, it was, I was thinking about doing it, but I chose not to do it because I wasn't sure. So, yes, I am an enabler and I'm very proud of it, friends. I'm not one of those that feels bad about enabling you. I'm going to tell you all the things and I'm going to make you want to have a million whips. I'm going to be like, let's get this started. Let's work on this, friends. Look, this is a new thing. You got to try this. Look at this book. Oh my goodness, it's all the things. <laughs> and then I'll sit there and, and smile with a huge smile and be like, see, I enabled you. I love that. <laughs> I'm very proud of my enabling. I'm just saying. I love that because it's positive. You know what I mean? <laughs> No, no, no. Anxiety who? Who's that? We don't know who that is. <laughs> uh, what is a suitable small project for a flight holiday? So you can do, um, let's see, mug rugs. You can do ditty bags. You can do um, something lightweight like, um, I'm trying to think here. There's tons of things. You can do, um, let's see, coasters. Depending on, like, if you're using cotton, you can do, like, coasters. You can make doilies. You can do squares. You can work Afghan squares, you know. Maybe you can work on a mosaic. There's tons of things, you know. Um, the ditty bag, yeah. It makes a nice gift, like you mentioned. Um, do you have your ditty bag close by? If so, can you show it? I don't have it close by. It's actually in the makes room because all of my finished work goes over there. Um, so I don't have it with me. But... I will show it in the next video. <laughs> Can you do a tutorial on crocheted removable pillow cover? Yes. I mean, it's very simple, um, but I can do it. It's literally a rectangle folded in half and sewn together, but I can, I can do that. It's just a matter of when, because I have a lot of my plate friends. I'm on hooker versus hooker. I have cows happening. I have males happening. <laughs> um i put sirens cove you mean S sirens atlas and then the cove on my kindle thanks for yes for sure yeah but see also two friends um shelly shelly husband she's got she's got like a plethora of books you know once you open up one you see the whole library there and then you're just looking at all the things she's great at what she does but she's not super fast about responding to her emails i'm just saying <laughs> What does my shirt say? My shirt says, crochet fills my days. Yarn fills my living room, dining room, bedroom, and closets. That's what it says. <laughs> oh. Yes. Guys, I am down to one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. I'm down to five whips. Twelve baskets down to five whips. Love that for me. Um. Yeah. Let's see, let's see. Is Mishy in here? Hey, Mishy. I hope you're feeling good. I know you were at the Plasma Center. I hope you, you're you doing good, well. Um, plugged in and all the things. Huge hugs to you, my friend, and thank you for doing all the things. Um, so, yeah. Listen, friends. I went over the hour. <laughs> I only wanted to be on for an hour, guys. I mean, you know. <laughs> but you guys are all here. Um, let's see. Are you making progress on the Bond Charity Auction Blanket? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. I am hooking that blanket like you would not believe. Working so hard on it. I can't tell you what it is because I want her to show it to you guys. My close, close, close circle of my, fa my family. My family is the only ones who know what I'm working on right now. <sighs> What is the update on Mama's Blanket? So, which one? Because she's she's got a few going right now. She's got a few going. You lost your crochet vibe in the middle of a blanket and can't get it back? I, listen, one row at a time, Tiffany. When you lost your crojo, listen. Put it down. Walk away. 
come back and say, I'm going to do just one row, put it down and walk away. You know, don't force yourself to work on it. Just, you know what I mean? Time flies when you have fun, friends. <laughs> oh, the forget me not. Sorry, sorry. Forgot about that. Yes, guys, my mom. Okay, so my Facebook live group, we were collaborating. We came up with this idea, the Wilma's forget me not blanket. So we were going to do squares, grainy squares with forget me nots on it. And that was going to be a thing. And then somehow all these other projects came out of the woodwork. So now we got to figure out when to actually place that project because I want mom to actually have that. Oh, thank you so much. Um, my husband said he doesn't want to like you because you enable me as much as if not more than Crystal. But he said, he said, darn funny. How does he not have a billion subscribers? Listen, <laughs> I am perfectly content with the ones I have. I mean, you guys are all wonderful. You know what I mean? Um, I'm sorry, Leone. I don't know why that happens either. It happens on this end too every now and then. You know what I mean? I'm not really sure why that happens, but yeah. But listen, a billion subscribers would be amazing, but I am perfectly happy with the ones that I have and my channel will grow organically. However that happens. You know what I mean? I just come on. I tell you all the things and we hang out and have a good time while I drink coffee or sometimes Diet Coke. <laughs> <laughs> we do squirrel things, you know, squirrel's nest. <laughs> but you guys are amazing. I mean, yeah, there's no other words. You guys are awesome. Every last one of you guys. Hey, Sherry, huge hugs to you, my friend. I got your email earlier. Um, are you going to do charts to do? Are you going to do charts, patterns of charts? Everyone crocheting should learn how to read charts. Yes. So yes, I will do that, Sherry. My very first one that's rolling out, it's done. It doesn't have a chart on it, I'm afraid. But the future ones will definitely have charts. It'll have the drawings and all the things on it. Okay. Yes. Squirrel. This is the sign for squirrel, friends. Squirrel. I decided to get the yarn winder from We Crochet. That's cool. Yeah. At least you have one. You know, we all need Easter plans. My Easter plans, Tiffany, are to make sure that I am on the live to see all of you. So I know, I understand Easter dinner and all the things for those of you guys who observe, but I like, I like a tradition, you know, Sundays at 6 p.m. Eastern time. That's just my thing. And so I will make sure that I am on there at 6 p.m. That is my Easter. My Easter is to spend time with you guys. So, Jocelyn, you can't believe you caught a live. Well, here you are, and I'm calling you out. Hello, friend. How are you? <laughs> hey, Fluffy Beats. How are you, my friend? Oh, let's see. Let's see. Yes, I bought one for 1028 from Timu. Okay. Okay. Well, yeah. Whatever works, right? Um, which yarn has been on your shelves the longest? So, are we talking about here or in the other room? I'm assuming here, right? So the longest are my absolute most, like my favorite, okay? These actually get replaced quite frequently, okay? They do. It gives me excuses to go shopping for more yarn. So I'm about that, you know, I'm good. But I these right here, these two cubbies right here and these two cubbies right here. Actually, let me just bring you with me. Let's go look at the things. Hold on. We're going to, sorry, hold on. We're going to scooch back. So these are the ones right here that I've had the longest right here. Two years I've had the longest right here. Okay. These ones down here, a little longer than two years. Um, I've had this right here, five years this anthracite. I just got this from my friend, Jen. And yeah, I've had these for a couple years as well, but these are the oldest yarns that I've had here. These here are fairly new. Listen, they say these are ombre, but they're not ombre friends. I don't know what they're saying. Like these yarns right here, look at the breaks in that. Okay. That's to me, that's just like striped yarn. <laughs> These are the ombres, my friends. These are the ombres. Okay. And also too, up here, I've had these for a while as well. Up by the roof, the ceiling. I've had those for a while as well. Does yarn go bad? 
No, you just have to take care of it. Like make sure it doesn't get like dusty and things. Bag it up if you can. If it's a natural fiber, don't put, wrap it in plastic. Use organza, let it breathe. Okay, just let it breathe. I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it. We're doing it, we're doing it. So here's more yarn. So these ones over here I've had for a while as well. But we're gonna, I hang out in here on Facebook. I don't do that on YouTube. So we're gonna come back here. <laughs> we're gonna come back to the studio. We're gonna do all the things here. <clears throat> yeah, if you wanna see all that over there, you're gonna have to come to Facebook. If you don't have Facebook, just hang out with me here. It's still fun, okay? Sorry, I had to tighten you guys up. Oh, it's all about angles. Sorry, stop. <laughs> anyway, yeah, little little itty bitty field trip for you guys. Just a little one, right? But I like to hang out in there. <laughs> That's the squirrel's nest over there. <laughs> I like to hang out over there in my jammies, my crochet, my camera. You know what I mean? Show us a skin of that old charcoal flecked, please. Charcoal flecked. Are you talking about the ones in the other room? Um, you guys want to see that really quick? It's um, impeccable. Sorry. Oh, by the way, my bags have air holes in them. I don't know if you know that. I should have said that. My, my bags that I, I have here, they all have air holes. Um, no, behind me. You sold flecked yarn? Where's the flecked yarn? I don't see flecked yarn. The speckled one above the ombre. Oh, that? Oh, okay, yeah. Sure, I can show you that. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on, here we go. This one right here, isn't that pretty? This here is Red Heart Super Saver. Jumbo Speckle. And soft navy and it's packed in there see that it's packed to the back packed to the back i bought all those skeins because i was doing the opera blanket from bag a day and i kind of got happy with <laughs> you know i saw a good thing i had to keep buying it because i'm like what if i run out what if i run out so i kept buying it and that's what i left over do you have a favorite colorway if so what is it i do have a favorite colorway Hold on, friends. Right here. That's my favorite colorway right here. See? <laughs> this whole thing right underneath the subscribe button. If you're not subscribed, friends, can you please subscribe to my channel? I mean, what other content creators does this? You know what I mean? Anyway, this right here. And then look at this. Okay. Okay. Let's see. You love the soft blue beside the purple. You do. This? This right here? What is this? This is aqua. We love a good aqua, right? So, yeah. <laughs> I can't believe I'm doing this. I usually do this on Facebook only. I can't believe I'm doing this on YouTube right now. <laughs> Let me sit down. I got to sit down and have several seats. Hold on. <laughs> Calm down with it, Juan. Okay. Let me just... Okay. So, yeah. I usually set boundaries, friends. When I'm on the YouTube, I don't go behind the scenes and things. But you guys take me there sometimes. You know, you, I'm engaged in the chat. Whew. Uh, yeah. You guys like field trips? <laughs> yes. Yes. But listen, guys... I appreciate you guys hanging out with me. Like Friday nights are kind of crazy in this house because I, I usually just put a video on and then I hop on Facebook and then I just hang out until, I don't know. I just hang out until it's time to go home. I mean, go to bed. <laughs> uh, you guys love field trips? Oh, yes. Um, well, yeah, I appreciate you guys. You know what I mean? 
we do all the things here. Oh, by the way, I bought bookshelves for all of my things. All the things that you guys are, have given me, I actually got um, bookshelves from Walmart, you know, during one of my trips. So I'm going to put those together and put all the pretty things that you guys are sending me on them. And I'm going to put it over in the squirrel's nest. So when I'm over there hanging out with you guys, you can see all the things, you know? <laughs> oh. Um, yeah, so there's that. Are you guys having a conversation without me? I feel left out. I see bits and bobbles of a conversation on the other one. <laughs> How was Mama Wilma? Mama is nice. I fed her early today, so I don't have to worry about that. Um, yeah, she's just hanging out crocheting in the other room. Yes, hooked creations one two three at gmail.com, my friends. That was the original name of my channel. I didn't like it, so I changed it to Juan the Yarn Addict. Why? Because I'm Juan the Yarn Addict. Hence the name Juan the Yarn Addict, my friends. <laughs> Hence the name Juan the Yarn Addict. Um, everyone, yes, I hope everyone who observes has a wonderful Easter Sunday. I will still be on, so, you know, have your Easter dinner and then come say hi. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> Just coming in to hang out and all the things. So if you don't have time to come see me, catch the replay. You're going shopping, Mishy. <laughs> what is my favorite colors? Yep, teal, turquoise, aquas, of course. Yeah. Oh, well, I, I had no idea. Wow, I'm glad I know that now. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. Yes, one squirrel's... Listen, <clears throat> tonight, though, I do have to pull out some whips, guys. I have to work on these whips because, you know... Crystal's uh, cow is right around the corner and I need my plate cleared. You know what I mean? Yeah. I need my plate cleared. We're going to do all the things. Yeah. <laughs> this is a great good Friday, right? Great good Friday. Good vibes. Positive vibes. You know what I mean? Just hanging out and having all the fun. That's, that's what this is about. Having a good time. And by the way, friends, if I haven't said it already, um the pattern for the Genesis scarf is completed. It's got all the information on it. My pattern, like I wrote out the pattern. I have someone putting it together. Um, well, thank you so much, uh, Fluffy Boots. Guys, that's Fluffy Boots. That's Naomi. She's a new channel here on the YouTube streets. Feel free to check her out. Um, yeah, she's a lot of fun to watch as well while I'm working on my whips. So there is that. It's wonderful. Yes. So, yeah. Is Jan leaving? Bye, Jan. Thank you so much for hanging out with us for the short period of time. I appreciate you, my friend. It was so much fun yesterday, and I'm going to love, 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 uh, you know, taking it to Mimi, uh, to, uh, what is her name, Lala? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> that was totally intentional. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Bye, Jan. <laughs> oh. I can play too. See you later, Vicky. <laughs> uh, yeah. So, thank you so much, Leone. I appreciate that. Hello again from Claire in Northern Ireland. Hello, Northern Ireland, my friends, from across the pond. <sighs> well, listen, thank you for making my Friday, right? This is a two-way street here. I come on not knowing what to expect. I didn't know if anyone was going to show up. But here you all are. So thank you so much. You know what I mean? I appreciate it. When is Bod's cow? I don't know. You know just as much as I do. She just put out a video showing us all the things. It's going to be seven videos, one hour each. And it's going to have seven colors. That's how I know. I mean, that's all I know. Seven colors, seven videos, one hour apiece. And there's that. Yep. Yep. And she's waiting for responses to when we think it should come out. I think it should have been out already. <laughs> I Like yesterday. <laughs> yeah. And guys, I don't know when all of you guys came in here. But for Sunday, one of Sunday's giveaways, for Sunday's replay giveaway, it's going to be a Stanley cake. Okay? Because maybe my Stanley cake could be a possibility for your cow. You know what I mean? So, 
Let me just show these again before I bounce out of here, okay? So you guys can see what the Stanley Cakes, what one of them might be, okay? And I'm saying might, friends, because I'm waiting for an order from Pleta. I did place another order. And if that comes before Sunday, I may change my mind. So I'm not going to stick with one idea, okay? So Stanley, right? One of these will be part of a giveaway. Bod pattern bundle in earth store 56. Okay. So I can make a bod cow with this. Yes, you can. There's enough in here to do that. So this one here is like neutral tones. This is a Stanley. This one here is a Merino cake, 1000 meters, which is like 1100 and some change, but it is a different weight. So yeah. Um, hello, Becky. Hello. Hello. Yes. This is a surprise. Sorry. I can't talk. It's a surprise pop-up. Wanted to say hi to you guys. So yeah, that's a possibility, right? Here's another one. Um, here's another one here, Stanley. And this is like a very neutral one. If you're the winner, you're gonna get one of these. Um, where do I buy the Stanley cakes? So I buy them out of Bulgaria. It's at it's on Pleta's website, pleta.bg. Um, so this is the candy, candy, and I'm so sorry, Leone. I saw your message, but I was in the middle of a sentence. Um, I, I do, I'm so sorry for that. And I hope that you're good. You know, feel free to email me if you want to talk about the things. Okay. Um, here's another one that may be an option. So this is souffle, Stanley. Okay. So this might be an option for the giveaway, okay? And again, friends, only one of these will be part of the replay giveaway. And I'm, I'm doing it because I'm hoping that whoever wins this could use it as an option for the Bodcal, okay? Not everybody has, you know, bougie, you know, fancy yarns and things. And this might actually be something nice for someone, you know? So here's my favorite of the bunch. Ready? Look at how beautiful this is. Stanley Muffin. Isn't that, isn't that beautiful? I'm sorry, I'm, I was, then on my Sunday, you may just get the chance for a purple. <laughs> Listen, if you flash a purple Stanley cake, I am playing this time and I'm not, I'm gonna be selfish and I'm gonna take it, okay? I'm just letting you know. I'm telling you, if you pull up a purple one, I'm playing, okay? We're not paying that one forward, my, my, my sister. Minus Schwester, I'm not paying that one forward. <laughs> yes, this is a muffin. Muffin magic, okay? Drops. And again, my friends, the reason why I'm not settled on a particular cake is because I placed an order at Pleta. I'm waiting for it to come in. If it shows up before Sunday... I'm going to change my mind and decide on which one. And I will show you. It won't be a mystery. I'm going to show you which one is going to be for the replay winner. Okay? This is a beautiful, beautiful red muffin. Okay? So there's that one. And then here we have another souffle cake. Souffle. Again, neutral, muted, relaxed. Okay? Okay? So not everyone likes big and bold. Most people, some people like, you know, understated, relaxed, all the things. And then here's, here's one of my favorites. Okay. You ready for this one? This is a vegan cake. Stanley vegan. Look at this. Bold red. Beautiful purple. I mean... It's all the things. It's, look, it, come on. The only thing that's missing from this for me is <clears throat> charcoal or like a, <clears throat> a slate or even an e-crude. Something to kind of give it some contrast, which can easily be applied. It's not even a problem. <clears throat> yes. Guys, the cakes and things, they're not expensive as much as you think 
for us, it's literally the shipping. I mean, that's, it's the shipping. But the actual cakes are always on sale, friends. They're always on sale. Check out the website. Look and see all the, look, I'm enabling you guys. <laughs> I'm enabling you guys. I hope you guys are, uh, yes. These are all cotton. They're all cotton. Um, actually, they're not 100% cotton. I stand corrected. I'm sorry. This is 80% cotton, 20 polyester. Okay. Um, I'm trying to see. Do I have any that's 100% cotton? No. They all have polyester blends. Okay. But yes, cotton and polyester. Um, is it the four strands? So some of them actually, wait, no, except the one they're all, look, this one right here is the four strand. You can see it. Let me pull it out and show you. For those of you guys who don't know what that is, see the four strands. They're not, they're not twisted. They're all separate. And so when you have this, you want to get a bead. You want to put a bead in there and the bead will actually keep the yarns together and then you can just go to town. And yes, Missy, Missy's suggestion right there, the froze wooden hooks. This, yeah, if you have a wooden hook, it works really well with this. So anyway, replay winner. It's hashtag replay. Come to the live. I'm going to give you the phrase that you need to put in there because it's not just replay. It's too easy. And then 24 hours after the live, I'm going to pick a winner. Okay. Blocking is important. Wouldn't a yarn with some wool content work best? Blocking works with anything, my friends. These have polyester in it. So you can use anything you want, actually. Acrylic is a little difficult to block. You have to block it several times to get it right. Hello, Nita. Welcome in, my friend. <clears throat> but I would recommend whatever works best for you, you know? Whatever works best for you is what you should use. Whatever you're comfortable using, use it. And if you haven't used it before, just look at what everyone else is using, you know? Don't steam block acrylic. Absolutely correct. Just uh, What I do is I just wet it and set it, and that's it. <laughs> wet it, set it, and forget it. And then just come back to it when it's dry. And if it's not right, reset it, re-wet it, forget it, and come back. <laughs> That's what I do. So anyway, I haven't had any, okay, well, listen, different strokes for different folks, my friends. You know, you don't, we on this side of the camera cannot say, go ahead and do it because it might not work for all people, you know, and then someone will come back and say, well, I did what you said and it got destroyed. Um, damp or moist? Well, I try moist first. I don't like to make it sop and wet. Um, I have Hirschner's Mill Ends Cakes, the cotton ones I'm going to use. Just can't decide which one. That's actually perfect. Guys, $14.99 at Hirschner's. There you go. I mean, the only thing that you're playing Russian roulette because you don't know which one you're getting. You know what I mean? You don't know what they're sending you, but whatever they send you, you can use. Do you block everything? I don't. I'm only blocking this project because it's recommended, you know? Um, yeah. Did somebody gift something? I'm sorry. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Whoever gifted whatever. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm running my mouth and I'm not paying attention. I apologize. <laughs> thank you, Naomi. Um, which project are you discussing? So hello, Linda. First of all, where are my manners? Hello. So Bod's, um, shawl along, we're discussing like different materials. Um, this, <laughs> yeah. So anyway, I'm trying to help out. Um, I'm giving some options here. So Sunday's giveaway, I'm going to give away a Stanley cake. And then also too, I considered this as an option for myself until I saw the actual pattern. And now I want to go with solids and I kind of want to make it like, I want it to have like this for me, this like masculine look. So I want to do black charcoal, aubergine, dark teal, aqua, and ecru. That's the look that I'm going for. Oh, and blood red. 
So those are the colorway choices I'm using, but this was my original choice. But here's another idea, ready? What if I ran these two together? Well, not together, but used it in the same project. I don't know, maybe. I think I'm onto something. This is masculine. This is something that I could sport around. I could wear around my neck with maybe a leather jacket or something. You know? Yeah. I think I can rock this. I think I got this in the bag. I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm just saying, you know? Like, <laughs> oh, well, thank you. I appreciate that. But listen, I don't mind making it and, and it, I want this to be for me. I want to make it, I know it's got like a feminine silhouette or whatever, but I think if I use my colors and I just rock it out, I can sport it and it'll still look good. You know what I mean? I just, I, I want that hard look. So yeah, <laughs> I don't know. Sorry, sorry, someone called me. <laughs> Anyway, sorry about that. Someone's trying to call me while I'm on live. Um, so the red one is off the table. Well, listen, if Pleta gives me my delivery, it's up. It's up for play. You know what I mean? But if I don't get my Pleta order, I'm probably not going to put this up. You know? So anyway, listen, I am going to wrap this up, my friends. I've been on here for an hour and a half, Okay. I'm coming back on Sunday with mom. I just wanted you guys to myself for a little while. I wanted to hang out with you guys. Before I go, friends, remember, Bag of Day is at 999K. Check your uh, subscription. Make sure you're still subscribed to her because you know how YouTube likes to kick people off. Make sure that you are subscribed to her channel, friends. She's so close. She's pennies away from hitting the 1 million. Double check. Make sure you're on. Okay? And... We're all going to celebrate once she hits that million, okay? So, with that being said, I'm going to wrap this up, my friends. I plan on seeing you guys on Sunday, okay? And for those of you guys who are on Facebook, I'm going live in an hour. So, come back, hang out with me um, in the squirrel's nest, okay? Um, no time limit. If you can't see me in an hour, come and find me. I'll be there, okay? So, that's all for me for right now. Um, yeah, <laughs> I'll see you all later. I'm going to hang out here and watch you guys leave. I don't like to close the door in your face on your way out. Don't forget the thummies. Okay. I appreciate you. Um, what's the Facebook link? Just go to Facebook and type Juan the yarn addict and friends. You'll find me. Okay. Um, Juan the yarn addict, you will find me. We'll hang out and do all the things. Okay. In one hour, I just have to have dinner. Okay. Once I have dinner, we'll go hang out. All right, friends, I'll see you later. Have a good one. Have a good one, friends. Okay? Have a happy Easter. If I don't see you on Sunday, catch the replay. All right? <laughs> Thank you so much, guys. I appreciate each and every one of you guys. Bye. Bye. <laughs> I'll see some of you guys in an hour, I hope. Fingers crossed. We're going to hang out and have a good time. Okay? See you soon, friends. All right, I'm going now, for real. Okay, bye. <laughs>